Welcome back, guys. Oh. Shit, what was that? Uh, welcome back, guys, uh, to Arkham Reported Plays, Moons of Madness. And things are getting a little bit mad around here. Over here, we've got some sort of Matrix-type bullshit, where uh, we've got androids sort of coming to life at their own accord. There you see it lurking down there. And over here, we just turn on the security things, and our protagonist just says, you know what, just go for it, just run, you know? Because we cannot hack this... Um, we cannot hack this thing. So we're just gonna run for it. And let's see what happens. Vamonos. Yeah, yeah. Vamonos, vamonos, vamonos. Oh, that wasn't so bad. I have a feeling we're gonna have to sneak past these these uh, robots that we're patrolling. Yep. Alright. This is officially... <laughs> turn down your earphones or headphones or whatever because this is going to be the official Arkham Reporter Screams Like a Bitch episode. Uh, this is going to be dark as well because... I mean, if I, if I leave my lamp on, these guys are going to see me, right? Alright, note to self, I will pump up the gamma here on this, in post reduction so you can see what I'm doing. But, I don't know man, there's something... Oh, we can hack them. I don't need to hack it just yet. Um, I'm not even sure where I'm, I need to be going guys, to be honest. I'm not even sure where these robots are. I can't hear them walking. You know, you would be thinking they're made of... Oh, there's one. He's coming. I cannot jump. I cannot run. Oh, shit. <laughs> you see, like in real life, I would just... I would just sneak past here or climb over this thing, but... Uh, Oh hell. Let's see, there he is. This little shit. I, I don't know how far he can see either. Um, like, how was the program? Okay, look, now he turned around. I'm gonna try to sneak past. Oh, you cannot. See, there's one guy there. He goes back and forth. I'm gonna have to sneak past him somehow. So he's gonna come back to me. I'm gonna have to hack this thing to turn it off and then sneak past. Alright guys, I am gonna fast forward until I reach that point. Just hold on. Sorry, I'm not saying anything. Uh, I'm concentrating like hell, man. I'm just trying to remember my days of playing Thief, Deadly Shadows, and that sort of stuff. But so far, it wasn't so bad. Looks like I made it. Oh, wow, I almost walked into that light there. Yeah, I made it, guys. Huh. It wasn't so bad. Oh, maybe I'm not so bad at this game after all. Um. <sighs> okay. Uh, left or right? Well, that goes nowhere. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh. As far as the writing is going in this game so far, 
I wouldn't mind think if things were building up on the mythos level. I'm not saying there needs to be Lovecraft mythos elements here. Like uh, more characters named after Lovecraft's characters. Like, oh, we got Wilcox and Delapore and all that. No, not like that. But I'm really curious to see what's actually happening in this game, you know? That's the thing. Like, um, it's interesting. I want to know more. That's what I mean. So these must be like the sleeping quarters. And I tell you, the music in the background is, is really unnerving as well. But sometimes if you play a game and you turn off the music, the dead silence is just also kind of brutal. Oh, look at this. The door got ripped off its hinges. By what? Who could be that strong that they rip off the door hinges? Did I, did I open that one already? Yeah, I did. That one, that one. One of these places is not unoccupied. That's all I'm going to say. This one. Let's go. This guy just so boldly... Oh, it's a toilet. He just... When he, op <laughs> when he opens the door, he just so boldly steps in, you know. Like, my man, this is a horror game. Oh, disgusting. Oh, it's all on my face, man. If I go forward. Look at that. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Your point is made. I will just go over here. this I would kill for a BFG 9000 right now <laughs> uh, well I cannot click anything ah there we go Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh shit! Oh yeah, and the option they give me is enter. Enter. How about close? Uh. That little bastard is back, man. Yeah, enter. That's very, 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 very. What I need to do right now. Enter. Whew. Let's keep it down the roof. And there's no weapons whatsoever in this game, man. Nothing. I mean, earlier I had the, uh, the little, ah, shit, oh, I died, well, thanks for watching the Arkham Reported Place, I mean, shit, oh, guys, welcome back, uh, I just died because I touched too much of the plant, we're still in, uh, shit city without, uh, a hope for us. <sighs> There's a monster lurking around. And, uh, yeah. That's not good. Alright, let's leave the camera over there. We can run past. We are literally running the direction of this monster. I know there's only one way to go, really, but. You know, come on. Is this what we really want to be doing with our life? Look at this. This is 
it looks like uh, like the description of the elder things from Lovecraft's story although they had five pointed a five pointed head oh my god I don't want to be going in this direction man we bring you the horizon isn't it the name of an emo band Ay ay ay. Chandra. Shit, look Mom was approached by Orochi. They interrogated her. What else are they hiding in this Project Icarus? Did they find her research? Did they find her? I need to know. I don't know, man, but I sure as hell wouldn't stick around long enough to find out. Well, so some of my parents are involved in this. Ugh. Well, I have really no idea what's happening in this game so far. No, no, I can't say that. I do have an idea, but this is terrific. Wasn't I here before? Oh yeah, I was. Now I have to go to the... Shane, the gate is opening. Get over here ASAP. You have to see this. Alright guys, let's go to... Icarus. That was the one we needed to go to, right? I'll meet you there. But there's something I have to find out first. You're all alone, little one. Sometimes I feel alone. We're both alone here. Together. Ah, uh, yeah. You know, I was happily to. I was happy to, to leave things as they were. I don't need to know. close like normal uh, what is this I have to be honest I do not like laboratory levels you know how like some people sorry uh, how some people say the water levels are the worst in video games or the ice levels for me it's laboratory levels What if this person is my mother? They said there that it was family, right? Ah, uh, come on, come on, come on, relax a little bit, man. They said my mother was involved in this somehow. So, what if she is this mysterious voice? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. I think one of the. I have a lot of questions in this game, and I think one of the signs of a good Lovecraft in story, remember this is a story first and foremost, you know, it just happens to be in the format of a game, is that you are kind of left with a lot of questions. For example, what the 
hell is happening over there with that plant? Like, what is that? Hey, 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 that's uncalled for. Look at this guy. Did you see that? Oh my god, that is... It's weird that they kind of chose plants as, as like the the um, the medium to ow 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 oh come on ah all right guys we are back with that root plant I we have to look for a command center whatever the hell that is. We shouldn't even be here, man. We should be going uniting with our friends, but Jesus. they Orochi has leverage on everyone. Hmm. Well, it seems like we're all a bunch of sick fucks here on this planet. <laughs> Everyone has some sort of dark, hidden um, secrets about themselves. So it seems like. But they've all put us here for a reason. As well. Hmm. Fuck. What? Investigate area, it says. Hmm. Shit. Oh, these motherfuckers again. Oh man, I am tense as hell, man. I have to say, I am getting to the point where I kind of want to switch it off. <laughs> look at these, these things oh boy is that Cthulhu let's have a look it's got the wings yeah that is Cthulhu right there that one there I don't know Yogg-Sothoth it's got like bubbles oh boy so these are like objects that have been dug up from the Martian surface and um, yeah that's not good Attack me again. Ah, oh, man, I, <laughs> I'm confused and lost, and I don't want to be here. So in that way, in that sense, this game is is really nailing what I'm feeling right now. You know. I don't want to be here. I'm confused and lost. I give this <laughs> if I was here in real life. I don't know, man. Uh, what is that? <gasps> what 
is that? That's a baby. A really big baby with a thing in his head. Oh my shit. Uh, one thing I used to do when I was playing uh, survival horror games as a kid. Uh, I'm talking like 13, 12. This was sort of like when Silent Hill Resident Evil came out. I used to play these games like really late into the night on the weekends when I had off from school. And when I got to a really bad point, like where I just feel like I cannot go on anymore. Instead of saving my game or something... I would fire all the shots out of my pistol except one shot and then I would like close my eyes and then just click the the trigger button and then one more bang and that was be like a symbolic suicide because I just did not want to play anymore and this is what my character would have done so basically that's that's what I, how I killed myself in these video games just to keep up with the, the role, role playing element of it what is that? Sir, that is grotesque. But here, you don't even. That is. What the fuck is this? Jesus Christ. So, this is kind of how I'm feeling, you know? If I had a gun in this game, now. Oh shit! Where? It's a robot. Motherfucker jumped out of nowhere, man. I don't even have a gun though in this game. And now I've reached a checkpoint. You know what that means, huh? I mean, if this is a boss battle right now, I am up shit creek. Oh boy. <sighs> yeah, okay, absolutely. <laughs> There is zero chance that I can walk down this corridor unmolested. Alright? Zero chance. You're trembling. Let me swaddle you in viscera. Stop it! Get out of my head! You go and crack open your head like a wall. Not in the spaces we know, but in between. A hand scanner? Looks like it opens a door to an elevator. Only discarded pieces block the path. Rain senses. Unanswered. I'm gonna have to find someone's hand, aren't I? Oh shit. Hmm. I was just guessing because she said numbers cease their meaning. My God! Look at this test Holy tubes. Shit! That's that's all of us. The entire Invictus crew. Are we the originals? The copies. Oh shit! Hey! <laughs> this is me. That's me. What the hell is going on, man? This is some... This is not right. This is not Does right. Split from a single seed. Germinated 
Scribbled on carbon paper, they multiply like vermin. Sentience is a glitch in the sensory organs. Pain, a cancer fed by reality. Oh man, this is not making me happy. Okay, the code there seems to be 9510. Look, but the, the person who entered this went nuts. Cut off arm today, right arm, good arm. Only uncorrupted parts, pristine. 9510, I really do not one want to go. One by one, they fell to madness and death, just like a child. So. <laughs> Man, why don't I just play like... Oh. Why don't I just play like Super Mario Brothers instead right now? Mm. We're all expendable assets to Orochi. It wasn't enough to know all our secrets. If they can't leverage us, they'll just replace us. So basically, they kill you if you do any of these things. Oh my god. Why are they cloning us though? And what are they cloning us with? These bloody doors. What are they cloning us with? You know? It's like they can make it anything. They could splice your genes with something. Yeah, I'm sure there's nothing in here. I'm just in the morgue in a horror game with someone that went batshit insane. Yeah, yeah, why don't I just open these, huh? You'd like that video game. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, all right, all right. Behind door number one. Nothing. Behind door number two. No, 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 go back in. Okay. Emo C3PO, they can just chill. Behind door number three. Oh god, that's disgusting. And I don't give a shit what's behind that door number four. We got our hand that will be acting as a scanner. So let's just use that. I don't, I don't even care what's in there. I don't care. I'm sorry. Go watch someone else's Let's Play if you want to see all the the secrets, man. I just want to get this. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit. Come on! Do I run? Let's go, let's go, let's go, come on! Do I run? No, 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 no. Open, open, open! Come on! Uh, ah, ah, shit! Uh, okay, okay, okay. Come on, okay, push close. the button! Close, close, close. Oh my huh? god. Yes! Fuck you, you plant piece of shit! Huh? 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 <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, Fuck you, you plant piece of shit. <laughs> this is my kind of protagonist, man. He speaks like I do. But that guy, he chased me very, very slowly, right? Why was that? Strangely, it tugs at the tides of the mind. It pulls the planet apart. Do you feel it? Look at this, man. My mind opens up to your power. 
aching for the pollinator bat. I hope we'll never see on the inconceivable dimensions to worlds of elder outer eternity. Oh, how rock has a shell. A corona surrounds the Eight headed monster. That's the name of the keeping here eight-headed monster all right guys this is where we stop the video <laughs> uh, when we're coming back we're gonna be having a uh, a meeting with the eight-headed monster all right guys thanks for watching as always and i'll see you guys very soon cheers